Hello everyone, welcome to a special video. While filming the video you are about to see, maybe, I screwed up and forgot that I needed an intro, so have this kind of generic gameplay intro instead. Just some pre-recorded Hotline Miami footage, because that's relevant, as you might have guessed from the title. We are unboxing the Hotline Miami Gamers Edition Collector's Edition box. And it's quite something. Let's go! So, here's the box. I've already opened the shipping box that it came in. Just to verify what it was and it was the right thing. So, I'm just going to check so it's in frame, like this, here it is, there it is, look at that thing, okay, let's get it out, and throw away this box, there we go, here it is, look at that beauty, and what's around the other side? Press R to restart, some screenshots, all the things, there's Gamers Edition, the ones who made this possible. Do you like hurting other people? Well, yes I do. So let's cut this open, plastic thing, oh this is exciting, I've been waiting a year for this. So, yeah, the campaign is no longer on, so you can't get this anymore. So if you missed it last April, I think it was April, here's what you get. So, how do we open this? It's oh, it slides out. Like that. Let's put this over there. Let's probably find this fucking tripod is in the way just a bit. Oh, okay. So I've forgotten everything that's in. I, I haven't forgotten everything, but I have forgotten pieces of it. So let's see if we can see. So we have a cassette tape of the, uh, the soundtrack. Well, yeah, not all of the soundtrack, I guess. I think they chose a few. And Roller Mobster is the first track on side B. That's a great opener. So, uh, well, I don't have a cassette player in my car, or else I would have that there. But I have the soundtracks on CD there. So, what's this? It's very nice. Nice illustrations. Look at this. Let's get it in frame and maybe focus. Probably a bit. Lots of dead mobsters here. Inside we have the cover for Hotline Miami 2 and first Hotline Miami. And if we. Another slidey thing. Slide this out, we have a DVD, same illustrations, and uh, pop it open, and we have... Uh, I just gotta check so it's in frame. I don't have one of these fancy cameras with a slide out thing. So we have the trailer's disc, with Jake on it. We have the Hotline Miami 1 and 2 on disc. That's both games, so that's cool, even though I still have them, but this is DRM free, that's good. And we also have a notebook with the uh, Richter on it, we have the Denaton logo, looking pretty fancy. And uh, here we have some behind the scenes things, very nice. All original illustrations from oh 
There's even spoilers in here. And there we have Dennis. Very cool. So I won't be showing any more of this since it's spoilers and exclusive to this actually. So someone probably has it up on the web somewhere. I can't slide it in, so let's just put it to the side. What more do we have? We have a little boxy thing. And in here we have the cameo cards. Do we have to open this to get it out? No? No, it's just some adhesive here. Ah, there we go. It doesn't matter if this gets damaged. I won't be using that. So, these cameo cards. Yeah, which I have actually ordered every... Yeah, the whole set, but... You got five of them in this box and they aren't even aligned properly that's nice shame on you gamers edition well maybe you didn't pack it so shame on whoever put them in you got five of these and these were meant to be some kind of trading card thing but since not everyone got this box that would be kind of hard so they released the whole set as uh, as an extra you could buy I'm still waiting for that one. Things from Gamers Edition take a long time to arrive. So let's look at them. Here we have Castanets, Lippy Sound, Magic Sword, we have Benny Smiles, and Sun. So it's all the musicians and how they appeared in the games because all of them were put in. So that's cool. A bit of cameo trivia there. Oh, I put it on the adhesive. Let's not do that. So, let's see. Is there anything else? Yes, there is. So, there's nothing more in this thing. Very nice packaging, I must say. They have uh, put some effort into this. Even though the glue hasn't really worked in all places. And this was glued in too. Everything has to be in place. Here's the last thing. No, it wasn't the last thing. I don't remember this. That's cool. So let's just slide this out. Everything slides out in this. Oh yeah, that thing too. Yeah. So, <coughs> just stand up to show it. Here is the Hotline Miami 2 comics that you could download for free on Steam if you had the game. I don't even think you had to have the game. Well, this was available for free online, but now in printed form. So that's cool. I'm gonna be reading this later, even though I've already read the whole thing twice. And just making sure to have it the right way. Here is the 50 Blessings stencil. So you could just walk around and spray this all over, even though it's not very hard. Just spray a circle with three lines. It's this way. It's very nice. I wouldn't use this. Because then you'd spray over all this nice illustration. It's cool to have. Here we have some sprites from the games. Probably some you recognize. We have the fans and Pig Butcher, and then we have Beard and Biker. Jackets in the middle, of course. And here is Denathan Enterprises. Very nice art card for Dennis. Good! And that's it. So the timer ran out on the camera. You can't record in HD more than 9 minutes and 40 seconds. So this is another recording which I have very cleverly and seamlessly spliced into the last piece of footage. 
nice, huh? Well, that was everything in the box. It is a very nice box. And I have been waiting for so long. And yeah, I'd say it's worth it. It was worth it. So uh, keep an eye on Gamers Edition. I'll put the link in the description below. Uh, because they do these things uh, from time to time. They have done Papers, Please and Kerbal Space Program too. So, yeah. And uh, also you can uh, nag on your favorite indie game devs to work with Gamers Edition. Because that's what they do. Oh, this one is numbered too. 1,292 out of 2,161. So now you know which one I have. Yeah. Well, this has been my first unboxing. I've been a little unsure of what to do, but I think I did okay, maybe? What did you think? Tell me in the comments below and uh, like and favorite and share and stuff and uh, yeah, tell me if you want to see more unboxings and uh, or less. I could just never do them again if that's what you want. And yeah, as always, thanks for watching. Goodbye.